Hi guys, it's Ella. So I am doing another review for you. I'm doing a review of Inside Out and Back Again by Tana Lay. It is an award winner. This is a book that is written in verse and it is about a Vietnamese girl who is really young and her family actually ends up having to flee Vietnam and comes to the United States and it's her experience between losing her father well, when she was really young and growing up with older brothers and she's the only girl and they're being raised by their mom. While this is fiction, it was based on the author's real experiences and so I feel like that just added richness to the story. I am not a person that usually reads stuff in verse. It's not something that comes naturally to me. I can never get the rhythm right, but this book was so easy to get through. And I feel like even though it was written in verse and it was, it is written in chronological order, I feel like I got to know these people in the story so well. Even just a couple of lines about them made a world of difference. I don't know how the author did this. I really don't, but this was so easy to read, so easy to follow, and I feel like to me it had a personal touch. It hit close to home, and so that's maybe why I found it so beautiful. But I feel like more people should read this cuz I've never heard anybody talk about this. Why? This is technically a middle grade book. But I feel like even for an adult or a young adult or anything like that, it would still be relevant. The author touches on a lot of points about race and about nationality and about skin color. And she discusses, I feel like, in quite a bit of detail about how she was bullied because of the fact that she was different, because of the fact that she didn't speak English perfectly, and because of the fact that she was just different than the other kids. This was a beautiful story and it was so touching. I feel like the underlying theme of this book was just hope. Hope that everything will be okay and that everything will get better. I wish more people would read this book because it is really short. Like I said, it is written in verse. I mean, some of these are really, really short. You can blow through it super quickly. But I'm going to read you an excerpt out of this book. This is Early Monsoon. We pretend the monsoon has come early. In the distance, bombs explode like thunder, slashes. Light in the sky, gunfire falls like rain. Distant, yet within ears, within eyes. Not that far away, after all. April 20th. That's it. And that was on one page, and I feel like the author just captures all of these emotions and all of these bitternesses of this little girl who just wants to go back to her papaya tree. Now if you have any questions about this book or if you have read it or if you are interested in reading it or if you just want to leave me a comment, all that stuff goes down below. I hope you have a great night and I will see you soon. Bye!